I'm going to point to him, and you're going to see it above our head. It'll be really fun. Let's go with the little antelope. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you can't. He said as the antelope slowly made his way towards him, Jim realized that he was going to have to go out on his own, fend for himself in the harsh world of evil creatures. He was an antelope with a plan. He wanted, wanted to sublease a place on Manhattan and start dancing. And maybe start playing some jazz music. Cut to two years later, an antelope alone in the streets, hitting the bottle, hitting the bottle hard. Where did it all go wrong, Jimmy thought to himself. I came here with such dreams, ready to dance, ready to play jazz. All of a sudden, he bumped into Michael Flattery, the lord of the dance. Michael Flattery knows talent. He knows it. He gave Jimmy one look over and said, I found the antelope I have been looking for. I'm doing a show called Lords of the Impala. And you're just the guy to help me. Ultimately, they decided that the show was going to go on earlier than had been scheduled. Jimmy said, I'm not prepared. The whole opening number is still just a question mark in my head. I've only blocked it one time. You're on, said the stage manager. Pushed him into the middle of the stage. He leapt into the air, leaping higher than he'd ever left in his life on two legs. The audience screamed. They screamed because he had leapt, leapt too high and his horns got stuck in some of the rigging above the stage. They thought it was a special effect. He moved his head back and forth and fell down to the, the stage. Four months later, Tony Awards. Jimmy could hardly believe it as they called his name and he limped slowly to the stage and took his Tony. Everyone rose. It was a standing ovation for a very, very special encounter. Suddenly, out of nowhere, an impatient lion came and devoured Jimmy. The moral of the story is this. When your parents tell you you can't, always remember that if you try just hard enough and you don't run with the herd, lions still probably going to eat you.